I wonder if she likes her new home. What are you gonna do, Blackfish? Oh, oh, don't fight. Are they fighting? No, don't fight. Oh no, no, oh no. They're fighting. You guys are supposed to be friends. Oh no, they're really fighting. Stop. Oh no, this is terrible. No, don't do that. No, no, you're gonna kill her. You're gonna kill her. I don't know what it is. <laughs> You're gonna kill her! You're gonna kill her! Oh, thanks God. They're now getting along. They're best friends now. That scared me. My goodness. Black one, I thought you were going to kill this white one. <laughs> white lives matter. I'm so happy they're together. This is the best love team ever. Good morning. <laughs> Pinoy Boy Mikey Bustos here and wow we have a giant day today it's hump day do the hump the hump oh and guys it's 5 a.m. right now <laughs> why am I up so early well our giant day begins with a meeting with the US Embassy I gotta go get some paperwork done for my US visa and then second on the agenda I'm gonna take you guys to the recording studio I'll show you where I create all of our parodies, all of our recordings in QC. And then I'm taking you to one of my favorite restaurants in all of Manila. And it's this restaurant is kind of like a privately owned restaurant. It's not like huge chain or anything, but the food is probably one of the best in all of the city, in my opinion. It's a huge day ahead. Thank you for joining us for another day. Eye bugs galore. Oh, inseparable. They're best friends, guys. It's so cute. All right. See this? This here, this building here, is the U.S. Embassy here in Manila, and they're very strict. I'm not allowed to go out there and film the building or anything so I'm filming it here from the street whoa big crowd see I gotta be in there so people are here lining up super early for their interviews they're getting their US visas and stuff for visiting US all right guys so now we're passing an overpass over Rojas Boulevard very famous Boulevard here in Manila and there's Manila Bay, yes. Now usually when we're going around, we're in, you know, Mandaluyong and all of that. But here, this is Manila proper, this area. It's true Manila, downtown. See that, guys? Manila Bay, yes. See this? It's a nice walkway. It goes all the way down. We're walking down Rojas Boulevard in Philippines. Ooh, you guys want the massage? This man can massage you. Okay guys, I'm going in. Wish me luck. All right guys, I'm done. <laughs> and I got it. <laughs> USA, I will see you soon. Woo! And you know, it's so cool because no matter who you are, if you're in Philippines and you're going to US, you gotta get your visa. So in front of me was, if you guys know Filipino celebrities, um, Vice Ganda and his whole crew were just right beside me. And he said hi and I was like, I kind of had a small fanboy moment <laughs> and then earlier I just passed Po Kuang and Coco Martin so see like the celebrities need to go through the entire process too to secure their visas and they were applying for the same visa as me I'm so excited oh that's relief from my chest that I got that and now we're heading to the recording studio Woo! I can't wait! It's the laboratory where the audio and music things are created. I can't wait to take you there. Alright guys, we are here at the recording studio. And this place doesn't look like a lot from the outside. But inside this door, that is where the magic happens. Mm -hmm. Alright, here we go guys. Welcome to 
Sumata sounds and good morning Chester. Good morning. Uy. He is the one who's going to be engineering today's recording session. Um, him and his brother own this studio and man, it's, uh, it's a great place. All of our parodies were recorded here in this booth. You name it. Balikbayan box. I'm getting Balikbayan box. Adobo. Adobo. I go to Palenque. I go to Palenque. Palenque. F to the I L I P I N O. F to the I L I P I N O. We got some drum sets. A lot of people come here and they jam. Um, see guitar. And sometimes I'm in here for hours. Sometimes the whole day when we have multiple recordings to record. Okay, so today, what we have to do is um, gonna be recording two tracks. The first one is a parody of the song Versace on the Floor by Bruno Mars. And then hopefully, I can do a second track of a cover, <laughs> a serious cover for my music channel. By the way guys, if you aren't following my new music channel, follow my music channel and subscribe to it. A link is in the description box. I just learned the song last night, Versace on the Floor, and I even posted a small cover clip on my Instagram. So also, follow my Instagram and check that out. So let me show you around. As you know, every recording studio has double doors to keep all sound inside the booth, right? So we have this door, which I close and I record, and then there's this door. And then this is where Chester sits, yeah? And here's his board. People can hang out here and listen to the session. It's really cool. And then that's where I record in that booth. Chester here is very, very patient with me. I am sometimes too much of a perfectionist, especially with the sound. I won't stop until I'm satisfied with the quality. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna record with this mic. <laughs> All right, guys, so I have my lyrics here. Mm-hmm ready we've been working on this for a few days and now we just record <laughs> okay ready i'm your average guy in this world a cargador working sa province then suddenly i saw a girl Okay, great. So I just finished recording the main vocal and now I gotta go back and do all of the backup vocals. You know, I have to layer it. We do about one, two, three, four, five layers for backup vocals. Um, I do two harmony lines um, and then I add all the ad-libs as well. So we gotta do that each separately. So that kind of takes time. It was a perfect fit to it. There was no doubt about it. It's a perfect fit to it, there was no doubt about it. It's a perfect fit to it, there was no doubt about it. Thank you. Yes. And now we finished recording. Chester here is mixing the song. All the tracks, we have to make sure the labels are good. I'm very happy with this parody. RJ, what do you think? Do you like it? Yeah, I set up to finish everything. And I won't stop until I do. Yes. Alright. How about it, Chester? Are you happy with that? Yeah. Alright. Alright, guys. Now I'm going to record the actual cover of Versace on the Floor. Um, for my music channel and a lot of people are like why did you create a new music channel? Why didn't you just upload your serious music and music videos on your Pinoy Boy channel? Well, because um, it was time to separate the stuff because I found that those who were following my serious music uh, Weren't all necessarily Wanting to see my Filipino comedy stuff. Um, so the, I found the audiences were really different So I figured hey it's time to separate the material and put my serious music on a serious music channel and my comedy Filipino stuff on the Pinoy Boy channel, on this channel. <laughs> so for this song, I have to just be my singing self and my singer self and not Pinoy Boy character. Okay, let's try it. Let's take our time tonight, girl. Above us, all the stars are watching. There's no place I'd rather be in this world. Can I hear that? It's warming up. It's warming up. It's warming up. 
It's warming up. All right, done. Backup vocals, ad libs, melody, it's all done. Now time to mix it and go home. Chester, thank you for being so patient with me. <laughs> Guys, Chester here is awesome at engineering sound. It's not an easy task. It's a very involved and technical process and you really have to have a good ear. You guys like it? What do you think, RJ? I like it. See, with all the harmonies, it makes it all full, full, full and thick. This is actually a very beautiful song. I really love it. And the final verdict. <laughs> yeah, Chester. All right. And just like that, we're done. Woohoo! All right, guys. So, oh, by the way, if any of you guys have any studio needs, you need to record something, even make a music video for YouTube, they do it all. You can contact him at Sumata Sounds on Facebook. Yeah. So look them up on Facebook if you need any of that stuff. They're really great. <laughs> Productive studio day! <laughs> Woohoo! So happy about that. I love when we have a great recording. It's just oh, fills my soul with love. Ooh, bright. Ooh. So the next step is to record the music video part of it. So that's where RJ takes over and plans the video shoot. And I have to write down the shot list. That's the second half of creating these videos. Are you happy with the recordings? Of course. Yes! Ah. Approved. Approved by the manager. All right, so we just came out of there from the studio and conveniently, the restaurant where we're eating is right here. <laughs> it's called Happy Lulu and it's owned by the family of Chester and Ton who own the studio. So it's kind of like, here's the restaurant and the studio's at the back. It's really great. So guys, check out this menu. It's amazing. They sell so much. It's kind of like Chinese fusion because uh, Ton and Chester are Chinese. Um, and they have so much good food. Oh, a lot of great seafood. I love their squid. We're going to order squid later. Love their chicken. I love their clams. Even their dessert is on plate. Mm, guys, this is teriyaki chicken. Their teriyaki chicken is one of the best I've ever tasted in Manila. And then we got the clams. Mm, it's spicy chili sauce. So yummy. And you know how sometimes clams, it's uh, kind of iffy because some people prepare it and it's got this weird aftertaste. But no, the clams here are so good. And then my all-time favorite, they do their salt and pepper squid right here. Oh, it's so juicy. The squid is so succulent. And there's the perfect amount of crunch. Oh, guys, this is the Filipino Pegasus, as you know. So good. And of course, we need veggies. We got kangkong. Mmm, yum. Beautiful masterpiece, guys. This here is turon with chalk nut. It's a very famous Filipino um, like candy. It's basically like a mixture of chocolate and like nuts, like peanut butter-ish sort of mix. And oh my god, and it's in there. And I think inside is langka, jackfruit. Oh, and then you dip it. It goes perfectly with the vanilla ice cream. Oh my god, guys. It's so yummy, it's like death by chocolate, vanilla, and jackfruit. I'm in heaven! <laughs> it's too sweet for me. Whatever. Chocolate and jackfruit goodness. My goodness. Mm. Mm. So good. I think it's so good. I'm kind of fattening. <laughs> Guys, 
We made a new friend. <laughs> What's your name? Kelvin. Kelvin. Yeah. Yes. Hi. Hi. And are you from QC? Yes. Awesome. Do you like this restaurant? Yes, very much. Isn't it the best kept secret ever? Yes. Mm -hmm. And you know what? Because we are Filipino, we're taking pictures. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, bro. Salamat. Thank you. Ooh, guys, welcome. I'm so excited. Oh, this is going to be so awesome. Okay. So, as you guys know, tomorrow is RJ's big day. It's his birthday. And I got him a cake. This is his cake, guys. See it? Let me pull it out so that you guys can see it. It's healthy because he likes healthy cakes. Well, I guess it's healthier because it's carrot cake. See? Oops. I, I kind of messed it up a little bit there. Let's fix that. Yeah. Mmm, mmm, it's tasty. See it, guys? I'm so excited. Tomorrow's gonna be great. We're doing an apple drive. So we're gonna be helping kids. RJ loves to help kids on his birthday. He's pretty much going to heaven, basically. It's gonna be so fun, and I can't wait! And I really hope RJ likes this cake, because I... Oh! Oh my god! What? Oh my... Oh no! Oh no! The cake fell! Oh my god, guys! Yeah? Oh my god! RJ, is that you? It's, it's ruined. It's, oh my, oh my god. Oh my god, guys. I'm, I'm gonna hide it here first. Oh my god. Oh, what did we do? What did I do? There's still crumbs on the floor. RJ, I'm coming. I forgot to get the souvenir. Yeah. Nothing, I spilled some gravel from my ants. I, I gotta collect it. It's dirty. So these are my gifts for the celebrity world. Ooh, <laughs> that's cool. Yeah. It's cinnamon apple spice. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> apples, you love apples. No! No! 